The Raptor lab water system for RODI is a game changer. I'm sure that most of you know that there are several levels or types of laboratory grade water. The American Society for Testing and Materials, or ASTM, lists four different types of lab or reagent grade water. There's a lot of factors involved, including bacteria, endotoxin, and other things like that. But what we're talking about today is just an overview of the subject, not a deep dive into the subject. Type 1 requires a 0.2 micron membrane filter, while type 2 is made by distillation, and type 3 requires a 0.45 micron membrane filter. Labs in their water needs vary greatly, but many labs and other applications where ultra-pure water is needed can be best served with our new Raptor lab water system. The Raptor is a game changer because it is not expensive, it's compact, it's powerful, and simple to operate, as well as maintain. We offer the Raptor in two models, up to 70 liters per hour or up to 118 liters per hour. This is a complete system and includes a reverse osmosis membrane, which is preceded by three pre-filters, a 5 micron sediment depth filter, a carbon block filter, and a chloramine carbon block filter. So you may be wondering, well, why does it have reverse osmosis? I just need deionized water. I don't need reverse osmosis. Well, the short answer is that you don't need to use reverse osmosis ahead of a DI system unless you prefer to spend a lot more money than you need. Then by all means, use the DI, just the DI. In fact, there are many companies out there whose revenue streams count on you not using reverse osmosis. Many companies have large DI tanks that they transport to and from their facility and then back to their plant where they're re when they're exhausted and they need to be regenerated. Traditional DI tanks can range from 2 to 12. It looks expensive, and it is, believe me. Here's what you need to know. If you use DI as the primary demineralization method, your cost will be likely 40 to 50 cents a gallon, depending upon your source water. But if you use RO as the primary demineralization method and then use DI as a polishing, your cost will likely just be 3 to 5 cents a gallon, depending upon your water source again. So the Raptor RO pays for itself. Let me tell you about an actual client who we once had they were spending about $74,000 a year on DI tanks. They were using several thousand gallons a day, and they contacted us to see what they could do to cut this cost. We recommended an RO system instead of the DI system. The cost of the RO DI system and the installation was about $38,000, and their yearly DI cost dropped to less than $5,000 a year. Remember, they were spending $74,000 a year and we cut the cost to $5,000 a year after they installed the system. They broke even in less than six months and saved almost $70,000 a year. The Raptor is made for lab water systems that requires up to, as I mentioned, 118 liters of high purity water an hour. The larger system is the most popular because you can undersize the tank due to the fact that it makes water 40% faster. The Raptor is available in four tank sizes, 20, 40, 80, and 120 gallons. Due to the fact that the tank has a bladder, it will hold about 60% of the rated capacity. So a 20 gallon tank is going to maybe hold 10, 11 gallons, 12 gallons. The tank accumulates the RO water, which is then fed through the DI filters. The reverse osmosis system removes 95 to 99% of the total dissolved solids. You don't want to store the DI water without circulating it, so we store the RO water and instantly deionize it as it's called for. Do the math. This is an astronomical savings. Look at this chart, and you can see that on one side it's going to deliver 10,000 gallons, but it goes up to 20,400 gallons. That's a huge savings. It's a cost of 1 to 3 cents a gallon versus 78 cents a gallon. If your water is more than 200 parts per million, then it's likely a water softener will help increase the filter and the membrane life and the cost of producing DI water. Many facilities have a water softener, but if it doesn't, then we have a mini water softener for an application such as this. It's called the Trax Mini. It's designed to pretreat water in labs or in, in other small areas. We're here to assist you. Don't get soaked by grossly overpaying for DI water. You can easily cut cost up to 10 times if you use reverse osmosis instead of DI. 
as your primary demineralization method. If you're not sure what your application requires, our team of commercial RODI specialists can help you understand how the Raptor can cut your DI cost dramatically. Even when adding the cost of RO membranes and filters, the total cost per gallon rarely exceeds five cents. Don't you have other needs for your budget dollars? We can help you. Give us a call.